There have been talks throughout the community debating whether or not the DBS should get nerfed or potentially banned from tournaments. So in today's video, we're going to go ahead and be taking a look here at the top 10 DBS moments in competitive. Before we get started, I want to give a big thank you to PUBG Mobile for sponsoring today's video, but more on that later. Let's go ahead and jump straight in here to the top 10 moments here with the DBS. What do you guys think? Comment below. Should the DBS be nerfed? What are your guys' thoughts? It's pretty popular in esports. Almost every player has it as their secondary weapon. So, it's, uh, you know, it's a good gun. Here we go. Number 10. Top 10 moments, baby. In esports here, in PUBG Mobile. It looks like we got a Miramar match. Got a knock there with a UMP, but we're not focused. Oh! John nade, bro. What? Yo, so he got one nade right there. Okay. Here we go. The DBS is coming, bro. Look at him. He's surrounded by a full squad inside the compound and the DBS. That's the second knock. That's the third knock. One more. Oh, bye, bro. <laughs> Yo, the casters are so hyped. DBS, guys, what are your guys' thoughts? Is it too OP? I don't know, man. Number nine. You guys have a conversation down below in the comments. Should the DBS get nerfed or even potentially banned from, you know, competitive tournaments? It would be the first gun to ever get banned. I mean, pretty crazy. So looks like we've got a Sandhawk match here. This is number nine, top 10 clutches. DB Look at that. Everyone has a DBS, dude. It's a DBS or a UMP, you know? Every oh, yes. Squad wipes. He clutches it out along with Finny. What on earth just happened? What? I did not even expect what do you think, that man? result. <laughs> I the thought they would, would be able to win that fight considering they had a two-man's advantage. They had all the four players alive and Magnus had two players down. They only had and two then players. That happens. Tables being flipped within an Tab instant. Whoa! Who tables being flipped, bro. Of the moment. Finny, he got four kills all to himself. It's a one on four. It's a one on four, ladies and gentlemen. Number eight. And so happened that the DBS was this is all you know this is all tournament level so this, these are you know top of the top players happens. in the world to get 1v4s is very rare but are you guys seeing a consistent factor in these squad wipes bro the DBS bro I mean <laughs> you know yummy what a, what a name yummy you know that everybody will carry, but you don't have any rifles. That's a full squad. Look at them UMPs, bro. They got the Vector, but I bet you he has the Vector because he hasn't found a UMP or a DBS. That's all players use nowadays. Let's see, let's see, bro. Gets the guy running through the door, gets the second guy. He gets three. Oh, this is the DBS King Yummy May. Oh, my gosh. Ah, good, bro. What do you guys DBS. think? I mean, I don't know, dude. I think banning it would be a little bit too far, right? There's been no weapon in history that has gone banned. Why would they ban the DBS, you know? But, I mean, I, I would love to hear your guys' thoughts and opinions on this. Number seven, it looks like this is PMPL EU. Potential there, but Tixie. Oh, backed off. Got the DBS. The DBS. Oh, he got both of that. He got. He got. Take one, and a third oh my God. A one v four. Play for Aza to keep Shockwave in and deny Gladiator's entry. The second time today, the Shockwave has shut down Gladiators. That, that was crazy. Dude, he got he got two players like right next to each other. You know, two players looking at you. Esports, I mean, and he took them out. You get me? Oh, look at it again. Oh my gosh! DBS in the hands of. Oh. Oh, hey. Team Secret. Oh, hey. Goodness, again, this topping of what the casters don't believe it, bro. 
The caster don't believe it. I'm telling you, 1v4s are so rare. Exactly. What just happened? Popped off Kenny. Sorry, Kenny. <laughs> Your limelight was taken away by none other than Aizen. This is crazy, Aizen. Wow. Oh my God. Wow. Wow. Wow, bro. He killed the top team. He killed the top team in the tournament, bro. Insane now. This is crazy. You're literally feeding the monster one by one without you know what I'm saying? Look at this. 15th place. place killed first place squad wiping the whole team. I feel like maybe a nerf needs to come to the DBS. Number five. One of the most popular outfits in PUBG Mobile has finally returned to the game, and it's the Forest Elf Set. Back for only a limited amount of time, PUBG Mobile has decided to bring it back via a custom crate. Simply log into PUBG Mobile, head over to the crates, go to custom crate, and it's there. You have the ability to ban other mythics, giving you even a higher chance at getting what you want. I opened the crate just yesterday on stream, and luckily, we were able to get it. Might just be my new permanent outfit. So thank you to PUBG Mobile for sponsoring today's video. Now let's go ahead and get back into it. Again, and they going in yummy again, bro. Yummy. Yeah, He's a player who we saw were in Sandhawk. Look at them, dude. They are trying to nade him. He goes down the stairs. He's confident, bro. He's pushing up a full squad. DBS in his hands, though. We saw the first clip. This is the second clip. He got three in three seconds. A squad wipe. What? 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 Yummy. What? Oh. Holy smokes, Yuji, what happened? This is... Oh, just nerf this gun now. Just nerf this gun now, the caster said. Didn't even the caster said nerf it, man. What? One by one. One by one, bro. No other gun can do that. No other gun. Here we go. Looks like we got number four here. And look at him. He's got the force elf. He's got the force elf set, dude. This is Johnny Bolte, I bet you, bro. Gotta be Johnny, man. His teammate was Z God, so yeah, this this has to be this has to be Johnny. Is that Shadow talking? Look at him. He's rushing. Bro, he's rushing somebody with the. The DPS is supposed to be close range. This man just destroyed somebody that was what maybe 20 meters away. 20 meters away, bro, with the shotgun. Full squad rushing him. Three. Ah, yeah, bro. Yo. Number three. So Hector, so Akshat. OP by bro. Water wipe in four seconds. Oh my goodness. XO. Forest Elf set a. Huh? Telling you, man, that's a. That's a full. Holy. Oh! <laughs> Bro, this gun is so. If you know how to use it, if you hit your shots, you don't. Die. I mean, <laughs> you just you can wipe any team in any situation. I mean, dude, that team pushed together, bro, pretty, you know, pretty much. What are you saying? Yo, can someone translate? Someone translate to me in the comments? <laughs> Number one. Let me guess. Ah, yeah, bro. This, who remembers this? PMGC, ladies and gentlemen, 2022. This was the final match of the grand finals. The best of the best teams in the world. Four angry men from China. S2G from Turkey 
wants to put another one in through the window there. Ricochet he already got a knock. Close. He already got a knock for four anger men. It looks like one of them is already on fire. Rage, bro. This is insane, man. Coming up right here, the top spot of the top 10 moments. He gets the second knock, guys. And guess what's going to happen? He's going for the third. One more left. Coming down with the buggy. And it's a one for dude. He is the knight, and S2G have raised oh, the neck. This deserves number one, but this deserves number one. This is the global tournament, dude. A quick refresh from them. Well deserved. They still have more to go here. Man, should the DBS be banned? That's the question of the day. Top 10 DBS moments in competitive. Ladies and gentlemen, would love to hear what you guys think about the DBS. Do you think that it deserves a nerf? Is it fine the way it is? Uh, it would be nice to see more snipers, you know, in tournaments and stuff like that. But uh, usually it's just the UMP and the DBS is, uh, is all that everyone uses, really. So what are your guys' thoughts? Comment below. Which one was your favorite out of the 10? Hope you guys enjoyed. One last time, I want to give a shout out to PUBG Mobile for sponsoring today's video. Make sure to go ahead and check out the Forest Offset in-game. Catch you on the next one. Take care, everybody, and peace.